Programming Node MCUs and other ESP8266s in Arduino is super convenient, but it can sometimes throw errors that can ruin your project's momentum. This video will hopefully help you get rid of those errors so you can keep going on your project. The first and most common problem is having incorrect settings in Arduino for uploading to your Node MCU. Personally, I use a flash size of 4 megabytes with a 3 megabyte SPIFS, an 80 megahertz CPU frequency, and finally an upload speed of 115200. The ESP can easily take upload speeds greater than this, but they can occasionally cause errors and 115200 is plenty fast for my purposes. The next most common issue is the COM port. From time to time, your Node MCU might randomly decide that it wants to stop responding to its COM port. All you have to do is go to Tools, Port, and take note of the COM ports that are listed. Then go ahead and unplug your Node MCU from the USB port and go back and check on the ports. One of the ports should have disappeared. Plug your Node MCU back into the USB port and check to see if any new port showed up. If it didn't, you'll need to restart your PC and then check in the device manager to see if you have any unknown devices on your computer. It's also a good idea to try a different USB port on your computer to see if that fixes the issue. The last common problem is caused by blocking code. Code uploaded to the ESP that doesn't let it run its own services in the background. In this case, all you need to do is hold down the flash button on the Node MCU located right next to the USB port and then press down the reset button or the RST button located right next to it. Uh, in the serial monitor you should now see a message that says something like Node MCU is in boot mode 1 comma 6. This means it's ready for an upload. These solutions should fix 99% of the uploading problems you have in your Node MCU. Let me know down in the comments if this fixed your problem or not. If it didn't, leave me a comment describing the issue and I'll see if it's something that I know about and something that I can help with. Thanks for tuning in.